please Giannis pay attention. I know we don't show him enough. We don't show him at all. Please watch Shea Gildress Alexander play basketball. He is amazing. Yeah, he is. On we move. Game one of our double dip. Oh, he's First time we've too. seen Giannis and Wemby on the same floor because Wemby didn't play the first time these teams oh, met. Oh, bully ball right back. there. Get off of me, little people. No. Or the guard already coming downhill, Ernie. Oh. oh, off the glass. Look at him. Ah. <laughs> I was loving the way Wimby was competing tonight because Giannis was going at him. They were going at each other. I love it. It reminds me of the good old days of basketball. Now, this is just okay. Now, Shaq going to get mad. What a move. Oh, no, it's a nice move. See, right, right there. Volume control. Right there. <laughs> You go, I can't get excited. I can't, wait, I can't get excited when a dude or a guy make a play like that. No, Shaq. you can get excited, but you can't get excited like you've never seen it. Shaq. I, I, I haven't seen it. Oh, oh, yeah, this is happening. Oh, this is, you can get excited yeah, on this. Yeah, oh, oh you, thank you, thank in your face, Mr. You. Buckley. Yeah, in your you. face. In your face, Mr. Buckley. See, Webb, I'll never forgive you for that one. Mm. <laughs> See, I love you, See, Webb, but I'll never forgive you and Nike for making that commercial. You dunk it on me. Yeah, I mean, this was a, like you said, this was a well-competed game. Yes. Oh, yeah, go get that one. He's 44, like, okay. 14, and 7. Oh, for Giannis. Check, that was nice. I'm Keldon Johnson. Good job, Kenny. Nice volume control, Kenny. Yes, that was nice. Wait, he got another one, too. Oh, he did. Oh, this was. Oh, this is it right here. Yes, sir. Go ooh. get it. Go get that. That's a ooh. Ooh. That's a ooh. Wait. So was my volume good then? Yes, it was perfect. Yeah, it was appropriate for the situation. 102-101, the score, San Antonio on top, and Dame Lillard connects. We got to show this kid Vassal because he was amazing tonight. Kevin Ho. Oh, my God. But what's his name? Vassal. Man, what the, what the Spelled hell? like Vassal, but is What the hell going on with his hair? Oh, that's good right there, Ernie. It's all dreads. I believe it. Yeah, Reggie you know, Miller. He came in only, hitting, only hit 12 threes this season coming believe into it. this game. Hey, listen, you can look. Connects Reggie, on Reggie, a couple big. Reg, Reggie Miller. Miller said it best. Hey, you can live with that. And you can live with that. Wembenyama tying things up at 121. Under a minute to play. And oh, on, oh, on you, this head. On you, head. Take that charge. Mm. It, 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 guys, you got to fall down to get to the this was This is impressive. Oh, yeah, bully ball. Give me, Give me that. No, no, no. Bully, 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 bully got bully. bully. Yeah. The bully, what happened to the bully? Hey, bully, yeah. bully, bully, bully got bully. in my neighborhood. <laughs> oh, <laughs> went to the wrong damn neighborhood. So you got a three-point <laughs> game. You got one more chance. Uh, and wide open three from Trey Jones, and he can't connect. This shot's right. Iron on kind. And the uh, Iron Eagle. That was a great no. pass, too. I had an idiot named. Oh, Jim Brando. That's right. I had an idiot named Rose. Paris texted me talking about Wimby should have shot that ball. I said, no, he shouldn't. That was a great pass. Guy got a wide on three. But, you know, Ro don't know anything about basketball. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Ro Paris sighted. Yeah, bring in Ro. What up, Ro? 125-121 uh, is your final score. And uh, this game deserves some uh, post-game yak 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 I think that's what, you know, everybody wanted to see, especially in a game like this. You know, a guy that, you know, has a lot of uh, potential, a lot of talent coming up in this league and is playing well at this point go against, you know, a multi-MVP player that, you know, length, skill set kind of is similar in, in some type of ways and athleticism. I mean, uh, it was fun to watch. Somebody I grew up watching and uh, one of the greatest players in the world, so it's always uh, extra motivation and I'm a competitor, so I'm, I want to go at everyone and be, be the bad guy on the court. Just seeing him up close, and like he's taller than you, th <laughs> than you think, you know, when you get up to him, like, whoa, like, like this guy, just his wingspan and just the way he just dominates a game. Like, I mean, he, he's definitely, you know, the future of this league. Just to ask you honest what advice he might have for you, and he said, you don't need any advice. I appreciate that he recognizes I'm, you know, I'm, I'm healthy physically and mentally, so I'm, I'm, I know I'm on the right path, but it's, doesn't mean it's going to be easy, but I'm dedicated and I know at the end of the day, I'm going to get what I deserve. And it's, you know, every game is a statement from now on. Do you like how Victor is? Oh, I just loved it. 19. I loved it. It was, I loved everything about all of them. There's nothing I didn't love about any of them. That answers all the questions, right? <laughs> Have a good night. See you at the bar. <laughs> all right, Pop. Sky is, uh, sky is the limit. Um, 
It was it was just great stuff tonight. Wemby dunking on that finish while still near on the ground. Got a illegal in at least 50 of the states. I don't get that one. Nah. Could have used, could have done without that one. And Good job, yeah. Domzel. <laughs> uh, so I think, I mean, in this game, you saw, <laughs> you saw why uh, Giannis with those two MVP credentials and a champion doing what he does and a glimpse really at, at a guy who can change the landscape of the league and Victor Wimbanyama. What was your biggest takeaway from watching what they were both able to do tonight? Wemby, to me, I've only seen him play three or four times, but tonight was really impressive because he was trying to compete with Giannis. And you can see Giannis is like, no, 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 not yet, young fella. So that's what was really impressive. And it, it, what, what was really good about it, Ernie, they played against each other a lot. You know, me and Kenny were in the back like, oh, man. They, no, I want to guard him. and he, I, I want to guard him. But so for me, this was... Wimby's best game from a competitive standpoint because he was really competing against Giannis and I love that aspect of it but man I tell you what though ooh, look at that that's impressive but I will tell you man the Milwaukee Bucks they got to address their defensive woes because everybody was scoring at will and you can only expect Giannis and Dane you can only expect so much out of those guys because you're trying to compete you're competing you're competing to win the championship. And if you don't get better defensively, you're not going to beat the elite teams. Mm-hmm. Well, Wimby just has to continue to get better. It's rookie season. You know, we, 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 we know you were the number one pick. We know you're going to be a pretty good player, but you just have to keep, keep continuing getting better. And then soon, you're going to take the crown from you. And soon, LeBron will be leaving and the league will be yours. But... You have to get better, get better, get better, stay injury-free, and just keep continuing to get better. Uh, I agree with uh, Coach Griffin. He is the future of the league if he continues to get better. And you heard Pop in his uh, in-game interview with uh, Jared Greenberg, and he asked him if he ever seen anything like that in the third quarter, what what he was able to see from, from Wemby, and he just said no. And and so he's doing a lot of things that you do not see on a, on a day-in, day-out basis. Yeah, and, you know, Pop is learning what – he's already great at like there are certain things when you come into the league you say well I'm great at this I think pop is still learning what he's great at because he's so versatile sometimes you kind of you're putting him in too many places instead of the place he needs to be at this early stage secondly the Spurs eventually are going to need a playmaker if you watch the game everything is one on his his ability to get it he needs someone to get him an easy basket there you know Giannis gets easy baskets playing with Dame Lillard and when he was with Drew Holiday prior to this. He get he got easy baskets. LeBron James plays with Anthony Davis. He can get easy baskets by cutting to the rim and things of that nature. There, Shaq played with Kobe. You played with Kevin Johnson. Like, there's no easy basket on a yeah. nightly basis for Wimby. Yeah. There are, yeah. Occasionally, I, I but played, not, on, not a steady diet. I played with two great point guards, Kevin Johnson and one eye Maurice Cheeks. They always got me six to eight to 10, 12 points a game easy because nobody can live on contested shots. What, what if Wemby played with a Jason Kidd? Oh, my God. It wouldn't be fair. <laughs> you, know, you know how much I love Jason right, Kidd. Right, right. If he played with a Jason Kidd or, or, or even Maurice Cheeks or somebody like a pure, or John Stockton, yeah, yeah. oh, my God, it wouldn't even be fair. Hmm. I mean, but, but the Spurs, like I say, Popovich, Coach Popovich is the right coach for that situation because, you know, we live in uh, in this society where everybody wants everything really, really quick. The Spurs are, they're rebuilding. They are, they're looking at the next 10 years, not the next two years. And, man, uh, this league, I, I was, you had to be impressed with Wimby tonight because he really competed against. In 26 uh, minutes. In 26 minutes. Yeah, 125, 121, your final score. Uh, Milwaukee. Now 7-2 and two in games decided by four points or less. Meantime, the Spurs have lost 13 in a row in single-digit games. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to hit him with that stick. We'll take a little break here on Inside and be coming something. back with more. Say something. Right I don't want to hit a man wearing glasses. Say something.